It's been so long since I've done a scripted video for this channel, I, I don't even know what I'm doing. I think I'm supposed to do like a cold open and then a title sequence happens. Happy Wednesday, Paul Talkers and other viewers. It has been a while since I've done one of these kind of formally constructed vlogs here on this channel. If you've stuck with me through my moving in April, thank you. I, I, I'm astonished and appreciative. But here it is, this week, the week of my 41st birthday, and I thought, well, if all those kids can do 21 at 21 or 25 by 25 type videos, why can't I do a 41 things I've learned by the age 41? The answer is I can do whatever the heck I want, so that's exactly what I'm gonna do. This is gonna be a super simple video, but I hope you like what I say. 41 things I've learned by the age of 41. Number 41, avocado is good and good for you. Number 40, a happy dog is good therapy. Number 39, ethics and morality are more important than laws. Number 38, as Hannah Hart says, clean up as you go. Number 37, only privileged people think money is not important. Number 36, gun deaths increase in proportion to the amount of guns available. Number 35, Oreos are vegan. Number 34, everyone suffers from some magical thinking and it's all dangerous. Number 33, fat is not unhealthy. Number 32, doctors aren't always right but go to them anyway for regular checkups if you can. Number 31, privilege doesn't mean everything's perfect, it means some systemic obstacles aren't in your way. Number 30, people are likely to believe things that they are afraid are true. Number 29, people are also likely to believe things that they want to be true are true. Number 28, the end of a relationship, any relationship, doesn't mean it wasn't a good one. Number 27, every facet of the United States education system from elementary school to, to college is as much of a mess as it is important. Number 26, you don't owe anyone anything you haven't contractually agreed to. Nobody owes you anything either. Number 25, care for yourself first so you can care for others second. Number 24, don't believe industries when they tell you what's good or important. Number 23, speak up for those who have quieter voices than yours. Number 22, selfies are a valid form of self-affirmation. 21, life isn't fair, but people can be. Number 20, every person you meet is more likely to want to help you than hurt you. Number 19, veganism is the best way to live, but capitalism makes it impractical. Not impossible, just impractical. Number 18, put people first, living things second, everything else should come after that. Number 17, age differences introduce an inherent power imbalance. Number 16, also, Asian don't raisin. Number 15, everything someone tells you is a hint about what's important to them and what you mean to them. Number 14, my feminism will be intersectional or will be bullshit. Quote from Flavia Zodan. Number 13, consent is active, uncoerced agreement and it is everything. Number 12, names are important. Don't make fun of them. Sincerely try to pronounce them. Number 11, people usually choose what they eat in order to survive, so don't insult others' diets. Number 10, every moment of joy is an important one. Number 9, you don't need any particular type of relationship to be happy. Number eight, as long as you are not actively hurting others, you deserve to be happy. 
Number seven, every human system contains racism. Number six, sexual orientation constraints are bullshit. Number five, gender essentialism is a lie. Number four, identity binaries are a lie. Number three, ableism is everywhere. Number two, you are not your mistakes. And number one, it's okay not to be okay. Those are 41 things I've learned in 41 years. There are probably a few more things, but honestly, not that much many more. <laughs> if you like this video, please share it so other people can see it as well. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe and I'll be back to a regular schedule once my life is somewhat in order again. As my life is in a bit of turmoil right now, never more than now have I been so appreciative of the subscribers and viewers who stick with me. It means a lot that you're sticking around. Thank you very much. And you've made it to the end of this video. At the end of my videos is where I always say, tomorrow will be even better.